welcome this is the energy vibration for the Aries Sun Moon and Rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for this wonderful um, experience um, please like share these videos and listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign it is the second week of December 2017 and I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here um, the energy of this week is a fire week so it's going to be a wonderful week for you Aries a wonderful positive energies are in this week so enjoy you have a lot of major arcanas you have justice you have the Sun and you have the energy of the lovers so um, for you Aries let's see what is happening and what is going on in your week because it's going to be a positive week for you Aries okay so this is good um you have the nine of pentacles so a lot of you will be receiving money so this is a good sign so um let's see you're also the middle of the week is crowned with a six of one so this is good for you aries energy of the magician comes in with justice it's not very good for you aries um, um the king there is a victory for the king of cups um then you have um the ten of pentacles which is good the lovers you're not seeing clearly with a situation and um the four of cups is here and then you have balance in a strength the number eight energy is going to be your um energy you have the four of the four of ones um if it's in business it's a good good thing you have um, or if, if it's in business or work it this is a good sign for business and work so this is good so let's go and look and see what is your reading looking like what energies do you have in this week okay so for you Aries let's take a look um, whatever is happening with you Aries if you're having a relationship with someone who is um, a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion there is going to be a magical event that is going to happen and what I say about magical event there are going to be things that will be taking place there are situations that will be taking place so whatever is happening the king of cups the energy of this king of cups this is someone between the ages of 25 and 45 um, it's going to help you to bring magic in your life and what is happening is that the magician is coming in to connect you two together and by connecting you two together you're going to see wonderful things happening Tuesday you have the energy of justice but the five of swords so there is a conflict there is this five of swords there is a conflict whatever is happening with justice there is a conflict so um it's not going to be a win for you sorry to say that but um the energies here is that justice there's a conflict with you whatever is happening there is a conflict with you and justice so um, if you're having legal matters if there is um, really situations um, that is going on and let me ask the question what is this conflict you and justice justice is blind there is a conflict so there is a legal conflict that is going on yeah it's not a win you're not going to win it's not a win you're not going to win whatever is happening it's it's not going to be a win whatever you um aries did it's not going to be a win there is there is something that is not going to be a win for you as we move on there is um, um a situation where some of you can be um glory over someone who's a um a Pisces good news coming from someone who is a Pisces this is an older person a Pisces um, a cancer or a scorpion there could be a glory victory or information good information that is coming from someone 
who is a Pisces or a a Pisces, a Scorpion. So there could be a victorious um, victory that is coming in because obviously there is a situation that is here and a situation that is plain. So there could be a good situation, a good glorious situation that is coming in. As we look at Thursday, Thursday seems to be a wonderful day. The sun and the energy of the Ten of Pentacles. So this is positive. There is no question that needs to be asked about this because the energy of the sun is success. It's the end of a situation. Money will be coming to you. Um, so um, for some people, there could be a win. Um, if you have a legal case, there could be a win with this legal case. For some people, it depends on what energy, what you did, what has transpired because there's conflict. So for the older people, you're not going to have a win for the younger people. Um, there is going to be a positive energy because on Thursday, you can see the energy of the sun and the ten of pentacles. So some people will be winning a situation that is going on. Okay. Um, on Friday, you have a situation with the lovers and you're not seen clearly. It's as if your spirit guides have been blocked. Um, and it's as if they can't come through. It's as if your spirits, it's as if you both are blocked. Whatever is happening, some of you are being blocked by, um, your spirit guides are blocked. So um, whatever the situation between the love is, so it's as if, people are sending negative energy or trying to block you and your partner so let's take a look and see because whenever the eye princess come in a reverse form it's always that your spirit guides or whoever that protects you can't see and can't connect you and can't send you the message it has to do something with your house it has to do with something in your house there is a situation in your house that is affecting your relationship. If you are married and you and you don't seem to be getting along. It's not that. It's just something in your house that is blocking you. Let's see what is that. There's something in your house. Yep. Yeah. There's something in your house that is blocking you. It's as if, you know, this happens a lot to people that things um, in their houses that's why I always tell people you need to clear your house of energies and it is always good to call in um, um, the angels and guide to um, bring uh, to purify your house because whatever is happening in your house whatever the blockage is there is a blockage in your house um, people can put stuff in your house people can send stuff in your house so you need to call upon the angels and guides to purify your house because if you don't do that your relationship is not going to be working out good so you need to make sure that the energy in your house is being cleansed so call upon the angels and guide and the fire dragon to make sure clear the energy in your house on Saturday what do we have here we have the situation of the seven of swords your emotion is as if someone is stealing your emotion your emotion is being you know blocked and you have the energy of strength and um looking for inner strength and this is a situation where things are array Things are really array and you need to look for something which is much better. You need to find inner strength. 
um, for this situation and that sort of a thing so this is um, a very good so whatever is transpiring whatever is happening you need to understand that you need to have a, um, you need to call upon the angels and guide to clean your house because obviously there's something happening that is blocking your relationship in your house Saturday the weekend is going to be a weekend so it says your emotion is being um, taken away from you and you also have the energy of inner strength and having balance okay inner strength and balance so let's see what does the other energies have for you guys and you have the page of hair the page of hair so let's see what is the message this page of hair is carrying for you because obviously there is a message that this page of hair is bringing in and it is good to know what message are coming in um, so you know how to deal with situation new ideas which is good um, a technology not yet proven curiosity new focus this call for great investigation as we are only stretched to the surface um, you don't know re you don't really know um, that's interesting if you explore this way of thinking what can you learn so it's about exploring new way of thinking new way of technology new way of seeing things and then you are going to see your way out in whatever that is happening around you okay so let's go forward and see what is happening here and you have forgiveness forgiveness so whatever is happening you need to have forgiveness forgive whoever and whatever is happening around you as I've always said you need to forgive yourself and you need to forgive people people are not very nice um, their egos um, take an effect on them you need to communicate clearly you need to understand what is going on around you you need to be aware of whatever situation that is playing out okay so you have the energy here of with the energy of justice there is obviously some people will win this justice the sun will come out some people won't majority of the people won't because of uh, um, an injustice whatever you have done it's going to have an effect on you now okay so ladies and gentlemen we can't always win things and we have to forgive people for things that they have done to us we need to move on and leave behind whatever that no longer serve us and this is what this week is teaching you Aries I want to say thank you for being here namaste